Hey, it's Armando with Hoosier Security. So I wanted to give you a little bit of help in uh, giving you some tips to help you decide how to select your camera system. Number one, get a demo, period. If somebody won't give you a demo, there's probably something they're hiding. Make sure you see the software in action. Not all equipment is created equal. And a lot of times that cost difference comes down to how easy the system is to use and how much of your hair you're gonna be pulling out when you're trying to find video. Do yourself a favor, always get a demo. Number two, get a full design. It's not simple as throwing a camera up in a corner and calling it a day. When you are installing a camera system in a complicated facility, you need to know exactly what you're gonna get. Get 3D renderings of what the camera's gonna see. Make sure someone's done the math as far as how many pixels per foot you're gonna get at the target of the camera. This is gonna make a huge difference in whether you apprehend someone, whether you know exactly which employee is causing problems, and whether you know a machine is acting up or not. Number three, make sure you know the problems you're trying to solve and share those with the person trying to design a system for you. Not all problems are created equal. Not all problems require the same amount of detail. Sometimes we can save you money or problems by selecting the right equipment up front. Number four, consider cybersecurity. And this is a big deal. Our industry is a complicated industry, and there really aren't all that many manufacturers, but there's a ton of OEMs. Those OEMs all come with their own trade-offs. So make sure you know who's making the equipment because some of the biggest ones, Hikvision, Dawa, They've got major cybersecurity issues. One of them, actually both of them now, have been proposed to be banned on military and government installations. So do you want that on your property? Hmm. Make sure you know what you're getting. This is also a good time to consider if the system you're gonna get has cloud access. Does that mean that we have to poke holes in your firewall? Are you okay with that? If you have cloud access going through Google or Amazon Web Services, you're gonna save yourself a ton of risk. And usually, it's either no additional cost or a very small fee. Number five, and this is one, uh, this strikes a chord with me. You wanna make sure you get an itemized quote. Don't let your integrator get away with just giving you a total for labor and a total for parts. Make sure you know what you're getting. Oftentimes we find that people who don't necessarily do camera systems every day at work get thrown into the role of having to pick one, select one, have somebody install it, have somebody else design it. So hopefully this quick video has given you a little bit of insight and uh, a little bit of help in making that effort successful.